how many schemes should really one be looking at because we sometimes tend to confuse mutual fund schemes uh, for stocks so when you're buying individual shares uh, it's prudent to spread your portfolio across many stocks but that may not be the case with mutual funds how many schemes ideally uh, i know there's no one clear answer because it depends on the amount that you're investing it depends on what your uh, you know uh, strategy is uh, but typically again i'm talking about someone who's 23 24 starting out uh, beginning to invest how many schemes should four we really have four to five have? schemes if i just put a number over here vivek four to five schemes is actually very good number to look at because the category which i just defined uh, over here between debt and equity there is no reason to have more than one scheme per category so if i'm having a large cap we always see uh, people having two three large cap funds in their portfolio now large caps don't carry an alpha beyond a certain percentage so creating a large cap portfolio within a large cap domain is not recommended if you have said let's say i want to have a couple of mid caps it's still recommended but but for anyone who's starting or building the portfolio having a four to five schemes in the overall scheme of things i think that will do the trick over diversification can also kill you and hurt you on this front so don't do that start with four five schemes and maybe you can build it up to around six seven schemes at best but that should be good enough for you